We're joined live by the winners of the final game of the first day of the SCAC Basketball Championships, the TOU men's basketball team, head coach Mike Wacker, and also senior guard Sterling Holmes. Coach, we're going to start with you. Could you give us an opening statement about tonight's victory? Well, it was a heck of a game. I mean, I think both teams competed hard for 40 minutes. We uh, were very fortunate that our guys made some plays, made some big shots, got the lead, made our foul shots, and then, you know, we were able to, to, to survive in advance. And I'm really proud of our senior leaders. I thought they really stepped up. And, and, uh, but you got to give a lot of credit to Centenary because they got a great team, and uh, it gave us all we can handle. But it was a fun, fun win for us. We're, like I said, excited to get another crack at Colorado College tomorrow. At this time, we'll go ahead and open up to uh, any questions there may be. Uh, Star, we'll talk, we'll start with you as a senior. You've had a lot of success in this tournament. Uh, coming a little different for you guys being a little lower seed, having a playing the first day, first time in a while. Uh, can we talk about how, how that looks for going forward and getting this out of uh, I think it's more of like a mental side towards preparation for the tournament. Um, like you said, it was the first time being the three seed instead of the one seed. So I think we just had to uh, prepare mentally before um, before the tournament even started. And I think we had a really great uh, practice the whole week. And, um, and we just played well, played well enough to win tonight. Certainly maybe not the best first half by your lofty standards. The second half, absolutely fantastic. What changes did you have to make at halftime? Um, honestly, it was more, like I said, like I was saying before, it was more mental. Um, going in, I knew uh, my teammates believed in me, but some of those shots that I felt were going in just weren't going in, weren't falling. So I just felt like I just had to believe in myself. I know my teammates already believed in me. So I just kept taking the same shots and hope, hoping they would fall, and eventually they did. Well, Coach, maybe you can talk a little bit after a storied high school career, uh, a lot of success at the high school level, your first 4A in the, as a college hit. I love it. It's the greatest. Now, I, I can tell you I've enjoyed the 17 wins a lot more than the nine losses. But, and this one is really special because, you know, the great thing about – college basketball is that everybody works so hard everybody's a quality program got great coaches got great players uh you know it's a big time atmosphere here i feel like we're in the ncaa tournament you know we i actually got to go in in 1988 with utsa the first time that school got to go and i feel the same you know so this is really neat and very deserving for our seniors i, I didn't want them to be in a position where they didn't get at least to where they were last year starting out, you know, and uh, they, they, they've won so much. They've been so successful. They've worked so hard. Uh, but every night out, you got to make plays to win. And that's how it's been all year. And we've done it 17 times, nine times I've screwed them up. We're hoping to get through the weekend without me screwing them up this time. But uh, I'm really excited and, and do feel very strongly that uh, the SCAC and the, the, all the coaches in the league it's been a great experience for me as a, as a you know high school coach the last 26 years, and then for me to have these kind of players and Zach Bear and Jordan Cormettis and Sterling and their leadership, and then all the other players we have, you know it's it's a great group, and I'm just honored. Coach Falky has also done an outstanding job. He's our associate head coach. He's been there the last two years, and we haven't missed a beat. So it's been a lot of fun. Any other questions? All right, guys. Well, again, congratulations on your victory tonight. Well, obviously, we look forward to seeing you in the semifinals tomorrow. Texas Lutheran will move on, as Coach said, survive in advance. <laughs>